Congratulations, Mr. and Mrs. Hall. This is John from Lakeshore V Center. I'm going to be walking you around today to show you your new 25 MLE. One of the first things we're going to note up on the front here is your power tongue jack. This turns that on and off. It extends and retracts right from there. To turn our propane tanks on, righty tighty, lefty loosey opens them up. Then you have a selector valve. Notice that tab. Whatever direction that tab is turned is the tank it's actually drawing off from. There's a green indicator actually on that auto changeover valve if you were to remove the cap, and that just lets you know there's propane in the lines. We do have a new deep cycle battery here, and then also a battery disconnect here. That actually has to be turned to the on position so we have 12 volt power throughout the coach. Incredible pass through storage here. We also have our electrical adapter, sewer holes, and our, our solar regulator there, which is just for our solar panel that's on the roof. Our docking center, is behind this bay right here. That's our city water connection. That's to fill our fresh water tank. And then we've got a black tank flush, which we'll go over that tomorrow. Hot and cold faucet there as well. And then an additional solar hookup. When you go to turn on your hot water heater, one important quick note is this is the 110 for the power for that. You do have to turn it on right there before you go to operate it inside. Okay, right here is our furnace exhaust. Do keep the little ones away from that. If there are any little ones, it can get hot. It is a good idea to check the lug nuts on the tires after the first 250 miles as they can become loose. This is where your sewage discharges from. There are the handles right there for that. Okay, you guys, walk around here. This is where your 25 foot 50 amp power cord attaches. It is a 50 amp power cord for dual ACs. If you have that, your fresh water fill is located right there. And of course, that's your brand new spare tire. So. I'm gonna walk around to the front and side here and go inside your camper. We go inside your camper. We got a carbon monoxide detector right at ground level there. Your in command center, which is located right here. Let's see, we're gonna try and turn that on real quick here. Okay, once that's turned on, our code to start everything is 000. And notice everything appears so while well, they're operating our lights from the interior here we simply hit those and to turn those on we touch these buttons right there so we'll do that with each function whether it's hot water heater slide control everything is actually controlled from that in command there with the exception of things like our stove and refrigerator and we're going to show you those controls here real quick there's your refrigerator control when you go to operate your stove simply fold back your cover Rotate your dial to the flame, and then use a spark igniter, and she'll kick right on, just like that. Keys are located around your kitchen faucet. Microwaves are pretty self-explanatory. You've got lights throughout the camper. If there's not a switch on the wall, or if it's not controlled from the in-command, then typically there's a button in the center of the light. Keys are around the kitchen faucet, again, and remotes are generally in one of the kitchen drawers. Beautiful new camper. Notice the, the ground fault plug in the far left-hand corner there. It's got a little green light. That just simply means it's a GFCI plug. It does have a breaker on it. So if you trip that breaker and all of a sudden some of your 110 outlets are not working, just double check those 110 outlets by resetting that breaker. Any of the ground fault plugs that have that yellow sticker simply means that they can work and function off the solar panel. That's your emergency escape right there. Simply grab the bar, rotate, and push out, and that'll open for you. You do have your fire extinguisher, extinguisher, which is located right there. And again, everything else, whether we're talking heat or air, is controlled from our on-command. You guys, this is John from Lakeshore V Center. We look forward to walking you through your new camper. But if you do have additional questions, please don't hesitate to ask. You can always reach me at 231-740-6225. Thank you and have a good day.